Previously on Buddy System, Brett tries to help Link find his phone by looking at moles, 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 and making some sort of light sandwich. But all Link finds is Rhett's super special secret, super secret special bike. Can I ride it? No. Because you know where Link's phone is. Yeah. It's in the clutches of renowned infomercial queen, Amy Brown. She is me. So while Rhett and Link head back to the restaurant, I remember putting my phone down on the counter. Amy hacks in. It was one, two, three, four. Uh Uh-oh. That's right. Enjoy. (laughs) There's a spot right there. Wait, why don't you back in? Well, because I don't back in. Yeah, but then when we're done, we can just zip away. I mean, it saves time. There's no hassle, there's no fuss, there's no nothing. But you're not really getting rid of the hassle. You're just moving it to the beginning of the parking experience. But that's when you want the hassle, at the beginning, not the end. After who knows what's happened, I mean, you could have just had your wisdom teeth removed and you're delirious, sir. Uh, you could have started a brawl in there, and there's an angry mob chasing you out of the building and across the parking lot. Time out, Mr. Mob. I need a few minutes to do a reverse three-point turn. When I'm parking, I'm focused on the task at hand. In this case, going back in that restaurant and getting your phone. I don't want to deal with the hassle of backing in. Okay, fine. You're the driver. That's right. I am the driver. I still shouldn't have backed in. Noticeable. I notice it. It's right there. Well, that's because you know exactly where to look. Close your eyes. One, two, three. Okay. It's right there. Listen, the person who owns this car is never going to know about this. Well, just because somebody doesn't know about it doesn't make it okay that you did it. Does it? Hello. My name is Rhett, and I just put an almost imperceptible dent and a Navy 1995 Mercedes-Benz. Sorry. You ding, I ding. What? What you do? Ding? You ding, I ding. I ding, you ding. We ding. Okay, I, I think I understand, but I'm not sure that's the best way to handle this because my ding's not the only ding on your door. I'm not concerned with other people's dings. I'm concerned with your ding. My ding. Your ding. Okay, I guess I don't mind as long as the dings match. Dings must match. Uh, I think your ding is bigger than his ding. You think so? Yeah. I ding. You ding. I think we're even. Now we are even. (laughs) (laughs) Come on, fellows. Let me buy you lunch. Oh, don't worry about it. We're not here to eat. We're just here to meet the owner to get my phone back. The owner? Hello. I am George, the owner. (laughs) Come. Come. Uh, Come in, boys. Sit. Sit. So, what did you do? I'm sorry. What? What? Did you do? I lost my... Yes. You lost. I find. Yes, I lost. You find. Yes. Yes. Is this yours? No. Uh, I'm looking for my phone. So this is not yours? No. Would you like it to be yours? Not really. You don't like it. Uh, It's very pretty. Oh, no, you don't have to compliment it. It it doesn't belong to me. Just do you want it? No. Ah, okay. Uh, Would you mind if maybe I just look through the box? Oh, is this yours? (laughs) Huh? No. 
George, we said it was a phone. Oh, yes, yes, yes. Oh. Did you find it? Yes, 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 yes. Is this yours? No. OK. OK. What? What? Oh, no. Oh, no, what? I know who has your phone because she hacked Good Mythical Morning. She who? Amy Brells. Amy Brells? The infomercial queen? Yeah, she posted one of her commercials on our YouTube channel. Did you know that the average person loses hundreds of hairs every time they shower? Stop wasting all that perfectly good hair. Introducing the Drain Weaver, the innovative drain replacement that turns your old hair into new threads. Simply remove your boring existing drain, install the Drain Weaver, and wait four to six months. Voila! That's a new shirt made from your hair. And when you install a different pattern disc of your choice, you can get more than just a shirt. That's a dress. Hi. I'm Amy Browse, president of Bro Life. Stop letting your lovely locks go down the pipes with your suds when they can be transformed into fashionable duds. She also got into our Twitter, Facebook, Instagram, Snapchat, Vine, Periscope, LinkedIn, Google+, Twitch, Flickr, DeviantArt, Dub Smash, and Nut Date. What's Nut Date? Oh, I just signed us up for that. They deliver nuts and dates to your door every week. I don't think that's what it is. But your phone was password protected. Yeah. Was it one, two, three, four? Link. <sighs> She's getting back at us after all these years. So how did you guys get to know Amy Brells? We both dated her in high school. At the same time. Oh, you ding, he ding. <laughs> no, no, we didn't even know we were dating her at the same time. Until the prom. I swear, I swear, by the moon and the stars in the sky, oh, I'll be there. I'll be there. I swear, like a shadow that's fine. You look so dope. You don't think this bow's too big? No, it's perfect. You're like a huge present. Are you saying I look boxy? No, you look very. Unboxy. <sighs> okay, guys, I'm gonna go play one more slow one, and then we gonna get crunk up in this piece. Yeah! But what about my hair? Because Chesma Corkle said that it looked like an alien and sucked it up, partially digested it, and vomited back up on my head. It kind of does. What? But in a really good way. Oh, thanks, Pookie. Link? What's up? Why are y'all dancing together? Because we came to the prom together, duh. No, we came to the prom together, duh. Unless there's another girl around here that's dressed like a huge present. No, just me. Wait a second. Is this why you've been sending me to get you punch after every other song? And you've been sending me to get you punch after every other other song? OK. Boys? Let me explain. We all came to the prom together. You just didn't know it. That's why I asked you to get into that big old human-sized garbage bag on the way here. And that's why I asked you to carry that big old human-sized garbage bag. But now, this is perfect. We can be a three couple. We can be a throuple. Mm-mm, that's not right. A threeple. We can be a threeple. God, that sounds like a good idea, doesn't it? No, it sounds like a horrible idea. I think all your ideas are pretty great. Thanks. What is wrong with you, man? We always talk about how we would get punched during the same song for different girls. And is this the stupid hat you wanted me to wear? It's not stupid. It's not stupid. What is going on with you? <sighs> Amy, this is a very difficult thing for me to do, and it doesn't help that you have perfectly quaffed alien vomit hair. I know. But this is over. I'm dumping you, and so is Link. Let's go. Oh, I don't think Linky Poo is going anywhere with you. Linky Poo's not going anywhere. I 
thought you were my best friend. DJ Fresh Maxi 5000, cut the music. I got something I need to say. Now, this is going to come as a surprise to you, but Link and I have both oh, been. Said it ain't impressed at the same time. You already knew that. Okay. Well, now it's over because the guy that I thought was my home skillet, my dog, my best friend has shown his true colors. And those colors are the color of someone putting a girl before their friend. It's kind of a maroon or a burgundy, not really sure, but either way, it totally sucks. Link, you're no longer my best friend. You're a punk ass. You're a punk ass. <laughs> <laughs> We're through. Linky Poo out. DJ Fresh Maxi 5000, you know what to do. Actually, I do not know what to do because we didn't discuss this beforehand. Just play that song that would be perfect for this moment. Okay, it would have been nice to give me a hit, but I got you, brother. <laughs> uh. talk to Amy again. This is not good, man. People are confused about this commercial. We're gonna lose subscribers. So what do we do? You remember when we were kids? There was that guy that got his <whistles> stuck in the hot tub jet? Yeah, Johnny Jascruzzi. Why? Well, he got it stuck in there for like three days, and he became like a local celebrity. They did a news story on him. And I heard the jets made his <whistles> bigger. I think it just made his ball smaller. But right after that, Amy got her hand stuck in the mashed potatoes at Clyde Buffett's All You Can Eat Trays of Food. She thought that they would do a news story on her, but everybody just ignored her. And then three days later, she pulled her hand out of the potatoes. Right. So I say we just wait, go on with our lives, business as usual, and then I'm betting that she's going to pull her hand right out of her potatoes. I know what they're thinking. They think I'm going to pull my hand out of the potatoes. But no! See, I'm gonna grab hold of their potatoes and squeeze. <laughs> Upload the next commercial. <laughs>